Hey, what's up, everybody? It's Viggs right here. Just want to send my love to everybody. Hopefully, everybody's doing good. Just want to share my report of the gospel. For I say, I said, Lord, who have believed our report? So then faith cometh by hearing, hearing by the word of God. So that's why I like to do these videos audibly, you know. Believe on Jesus Christ, the Lord Jesus Christ, the Son of God. He came unto his own in Jerusalem and they received him not. They found no cause of death in him. Still yet they desired Pilate that he should be slain. After that, they had him crucified. They they buried him for three days, right? For three days and for three nights. It says, just like as um, Jonah was in the whale's belly for three days, so shall a sin of man also be in the heart of the earth for three days and for three nights. And on the third day, God rose his son from the grave. And he was seen alive by over 500 brethren. Romans 1, 16, it says, For I am not ashamed of the gospel of Christ, for it is the power of God unto salvation to everyone that believeth, to the Jew first and also to the Greek. 1 Corinthians 15, our apostle Paul, he declares the gospel to the church. It reads, more of a brethren, I declare unto the gospel which I preached unto you, which also ye have received, and where ye stand, by which also ye are saved, if ye keep in memory what I preached unto you, unless ye have believed in vain. For I delivered unto you first of all that which I also received, how that Christ died for our sins according to the scriptures, and that he was buried, and that he rose again the third day according to the scriptures, and that he was seen as Cephas, then of the twelve. After that he was seen of above five hundred brethren at once, of whom the greater part remain to this present, but some are falling asleep. After that, he was seen at James and of all the apostles. And last of all, he was seen in me also as a one born out of due time. So that was 1 Corinthians 15, 1, 3, where our apostle Paul declares the gospel to the church. In Ephesians 1, 13, it says, in whom, ye has, in whom ye also trusted, after that ye heard the word of truth, the gospel of your salvation. And whom also after that ye believed, you were sealed with that Holy Spirit of promise. The scripture says in 1 Corinthians chapter 1, For after that in the wisdom of God, the world by wisdom knew not God. It pleased God by the foolishness of preaching to save them that believe. Jesus talks about the parable of the sower. He says, if you don't know this parable, how can you know any of the parables, right? It says, those by the way said, are they that hear, then come with the devil and take it away the word out of their hearts, lest they should believe and be saved. So the parable sows the, sows the word, right? So I just sowed the word, you know, faith cometh by hearing. In the scripture, um, it says, And we have seen and do testify that the Father sent the Son to be the Savior of the world. Whosoever shall confess that Jesus is the Son of God, God dwelleth in him and he in God, according to the scriptures. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. That's actually the work of God is to believe on him whom he has sent as it is written in John 6, right? So I pray you guys believe that. Jesus says, Verily, verily, I say unto you, he that believeth on me hath everlasting life. John 3.36 says, He that believeth on the Son hath everlasting life. And he that believeth not the Son shall not see life, but the wrath of God abideth on him. But these are written that ye might believe that Jesus is the Christ, the Son of God, and that believing ye might have life through his name. His name is Jesus. That's the only name that saves according to the scriptures. There is none, no other name under heaven given among men whereby we must be saved. And that is the Lord Jesus. The scripture says in Romans 10, 9, right? That if thou shalt confess with thy mouth, the Lord Jesus shall believe in thy heart that God hath raised him from the dead, thou shalt be saved. Have a good one, everybody. I send my love, man. It's beautiful today.